Dr. Mark Norton, a clinical oncologist, is preparing to see a patient. He logs into the electronic medical record, and instead of spending time trying to find relevant information, he uses the IBM Watson Oncology Diagnosis and Treatment Advisor. He pushes the Ask Watson button and... Watson analyzes the patient data against tens of thousands of documents from its vast body of medical literature. Dr. Norton starts with the Case Information tab where Watson has pulled out the relevant information, as well as suggestions for additional information to gather. Moving to the Test Options tab, he sees tests that Watson suggests that he consider ordering. He presses the Evidence button to see the reasons why Watson suggested the first test. Then he drills down further into a specific reference that supports the suggestion. Once the results of the tests come in, Dr. Norton presses the Treatment Options tab to see a panel of suggested confidence-scored treatments. He also sees a list of clinical trials to consider. Again, he reviews the supporting documentation by pushing the Evidence button. Dr. Norton has new information to add to the case, so he pushes the blue Watson avatar on the bottom and speaks directly into the microphone. He makes sure that his words have been transcribed correctly and submits the new information. Watson returns a revised set of confidence-scored treatment suggestions that take the new information into account. It also updates the list of clinical trials to consider. Shifting gears from Dr. Gordon's role to that of a hospital or health plan administrator, the advisor provides a customizable dashboard showing key performance indicators like where the advisor is being used, how it's performing, and what information sources are most useful. The administrator can drill down into the data more specifically to get more details, such as performance over different time spans, metrics on specific types of cancer, or in this case, a narrower geographic area. This is just one of the many areas that Watson's cognitive capabilities can be applied to help people live and work in better ways.